So, there's a video around YouTube, which is um, My Perfect Imperfections, which I've watched quite a few of them, and I think they're actually like a really good thing to um, produce. Because I think it's nice to show people that you, like, everyone has insecurities, I guess. And even though, um, I guess some people say, oh, I don't think that's, like, a problem. Uh, like, yourself, you think, I don't like a certain part of me, which is, like, most people must have this. So I think it's nice to, um, show the viewers of YouTube that not everyone thinks they're perfect. And it's, um, nice to express your insecurities as well as the things that make you feel, um, better about yourself, I guess. So yeah, I've watched um, a few people's videos, about, I don't know, about five or six, and I think all their imperfections are silly, and I think they all look perfect. But then, yeah, they, they probably notice it more than I do, because they have to live with it. So, the idea of my um, perfect imperfections is to name three things that you like about yourself, and three things you don't. So to start off with, I'm going to... Um, pick one thing I really don't like about myself which is the bump in my nose it's not really a bump but at the top of my nose I have like I can't even see it this is the bone here you see what I'm saying it's like um because my nose is quite thin there's like the bone here goes in like a triangle right to here like I've I've mentioned it some people and they go oh yeah I notice it now but like before they didn't notice it, which is probably like, you know, my mind per usual. So that's one thing I totally hate about myself, but I would never consider getting it changed because I don't know. I don't like um, the idea of surgery on myself. But yeah, that's one thing I would com like, I completely don't like, which I would say is imperfect about myself. Um, secondly, I would say that my one of my imperfections, which I really dislike, is my lips. I'm trying to keep like, um, what do you call it, a serious face. My top lip is really, really thin. And I've tried things like lip pumping, lip glosses, and other things like that. And they don't work for me. Well, some of them do, but I, I didn't have like a great reaction to some of them. Some of them gave me like, really like bee stung lips so it's not such a great reaction so yeah if you can see my top lip is really thin yeah so that's another thing I really dislike about myself um the third thing I really 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 hate which will be kind of like in reflection on one of my things I do like is the transparency of my skin my skin like my mother's is very very thin so, um, on like certain parts of my face, you can see like veins, like here, you can see this vein here. And I put like powder and stuff on my face to make them look less noticeable, but yeah, still you can see them like on this side as well. It's only really here and like above here, you can usually see them, but I cover this part in eyeshadow so you can't see them here now. So yeah, that's my three imperfections. Um, so one thing I like, I, I wouldn't say it's perfect, but one thing I like about myself would have to be my skin. I know I said that I don't like my skin because it's transparent, however I do like my skin because it's, I hardly ever get spots. It's really soft and <laughs> you can't really see it on the camera, but my skin is olivey. I have, um, my dad's skin is quite dark and therefore I have quite dark skin, which is, I don't, um, like my friends are quite pale in the winter, I will stay, like, I have a tan all year round on my face, which I love. So yeah, I don't get any spots, and it's super soft, and even taking into consideration I have really thin skin, I do love that. I have quite good skin at that. Um, the second thing I really like about myself is my eye colour. My eye colour is kind of a love-hate with me. Sometimes I would go, oh, I wish I had blue eyes, because most blondes have blue eyes. But other times I'm like, oh, you know, I'm blessed with a different colour eye. Like, with this camera, I don't think you can see it that well. But I have dark green eyes, which I'll try and show you. Yeah, I have dark green eyes. Um, and they're quite large and round, which I also like. It's quite weird, because two of my sisters um, have blue eyes. 
and my mum and dad both have blue eyes and I'm the only one with green eyes but you know whatever yeah so I'm really like blessed with my eye colour and I look really good in photos and things like that because they're quite bright um, and lastly I like my hair it's I don't like the colour well the colour's okay but what I love is how versatile my hair is my hair will do anything at the moment it's in a fishtail which my friend did because I can't actually do it myself but yeah, it's so versatile. If I want to curl it, it will curl. If I want it um, wavy, it will go wavy. If I want it straight, you know, uh, etc. Yeah, so um, at the moment, the colour, I have it blonde, which is, this is not my natural blonde, but I am naturally blonde, but not as blonde as this. But at the moment, it's been behaving, and because the winter's coming, it usually looks better in the summer than it does in the winter, but the products I'm using in my hair at the moment make it look, if you can see, like, really shiny, and have this really natural shine to it. So yeah, so that's my three imperfections and the three things I like about myself. So I think it's a good thing for everyone who sees this video to make their own um, perfect imperfection video in order just to express that um, not everyone, well, nobody is perfect. And I think it's nice that like even things that other people don't notice, it's nice to show people that we do see things that we don't like about ourselves. And so yeah, so thanks for watching this video guys and keep subscribing.